after this news summary. Thousands of protesters marched through Chicago's rainy retail district today, voicing their anger against the shooting death of a black teenager by a Chicago policeman last year. The magnificent mile on Chicago's Michigan Avenue the day after Thanksgiving, usually filled with holiday shoppers, today flooded with protesters. Thousands marched along the main artery, while others blocked store entrances to take part in so-called Blackout Friday. Their goal, to shut down the busy retail district to protest the shooting death of 17-year-old Laquan McDonald. We have to come together, and it's power and impact when you touch the, ec the economy. And that's what we're trying to do. The police are murdering people in the city with no repercussions. They can't do that. You charge one officer and there's hundreds of other children dead with no charges. Today's demonstrations are the latest since the city's police department released video Tuesday night of the shooting. It showed Officer Jason Van Dyke, who is white, firing at McDonald, who was black, 16 times. Most struck him while he was on the ground. McDonald, who was holding a knife, had allegedly punctured the tires of a police car. Prior to the video's release, Van Dyke was charged with first-degree murder. But today, many, including the Reverend Jesse Jackson, one of the event's organizers, said protests will continue. We will escalate marches on Michigan Avenue until... On un Michigan Avenue? On Michigan Avenue until the city, in fact, the, those who are, who are the beneficiaries of our largesse are able to come to the table. Demonstrators are calling for the resignation of the city's police chief and one of its top prosecutors. 